Well, hello there. My name is Tom Green, and I'm looking forward to guiding you through the many features of Adobe Edge Animate. As a professor of interactive media, the author of well over a dozen books, and the user of Edge Animate since its release in mid-2011, I'm looking forward to sharing what I have learned about this software. Adobe in mid-2011 started to shift its focus away from traditional animation applications to what they are calling the Expressive Web. The Expressive Web uses HTML, CSS3, jQuery, and a number of other technologies to create some pretty amazing interactive work for everything from your computer to the smartphone in your pocket. In this course, I plan to show you where Edge Animate fits into the Expressive Web workflow and why it is poised to become a key tool in creating projects ranging from animations, interactive applications, and even putting the elements of existing web pages into motion. In this course, we'll explore the Edge Animate interface and then dive into using each tool, from keyframes and the pin to nesting and sprite sheets. After that, we will explore how to include and use graphics and type. The fun then really starts when we jump into adding some real interactivity with symbols, navigation, triggers, stage scripts, and more. After you learn to create in Edge Animate, you will then see how it works beautifully with Dreamweaver and many other applications. After watching these lessons, I think you will agree that Edge Animate can become an incredibly powerful and useful tool in your motion graphics toolbox. I also hope you find these lessons to be both educational and inspirational. So much for talking about what you can do. Let's start digging into Edge Animate and actually start building stuff.